Hi, welcome back to Impossible. Next up, I have Cancer. So, as you already know, Cancer is this going to be your weekly motivation? The time now is 6.08, so 14 is 5. Changes. So, huge changes all the way. Making the necessary changes within yourself. Changing residence, changing job. Just changes. <laughs> okay, so let's see what Angel, uh, your, your Oracle messages come out to you this week. It says, Rick Biel, on the move. Okay. The chariot is cancer, so you're moving. You're on the go. Changes. Change of location, okay? But definitely, you're on the go. Okay, 16 and 7, your blessings are definitely coming in. Some of you guys may belong to the LGBTQ community as well. Your blessings are uh, coming in as well. I do see somebody coming in uh, as well. But your blessings are coming in, okay? And you're on the go, all right? But Rick Biel, ruler of the divine chariot, movement, Dynamic action. You're all about action, coordination, teleportation, fights and defeats chaos. So your angels, your spirit guides are fighting and defeating anything because some of you guys is like uh, chaos in your surroundings. There's too much going on and you're moving forward uh, past it. Okay. I show to you from storms and show you how to use your macabre to become a chariot of the divine power. Smoky quartz, full moon and go. So you're definitely on the go. Okay. All right, let me get your affirmations. I have a lot of work to do tonight, uh, Cancers. <clears throat> I was going to say chariot. <laughs> okay, some of you guys may love horse, horseback riding, but I am fully aligned with the present. I am fully aligned with the present. So you're coming in alignment, guys. I am fully aligned with the present. Okay, let me get your money block affirmation. Gold digger. Uh-oh. Okay, so, <laughs> all right? But gold diggers. Okay, so be careful with gold diggers or people trying to use you for money, stuff like that. Okay, but let's, let's see what it says. Release people who only want you for money. Just, I was just saying that, right? So release people who only want you for money. I am loved for who I am. You're leaving these people in the dust. I am loved for who I am. I am loved for who I am. Okay? That's it. You ain't got no money to give, okay? <laughs> Basically, that is not being selfish or stingy. But, you know, hey, listen. You help, you help. But when it comes a habit of borrowing, borrowing, no. Okay? So, let's see here. It says, extraterrestrial, you're out of this world, okay? You may be feeling outcasted or different. You're ascending, okay? You're coming in alignment. You're coming in alignment with your life purpose and what you're here for. Okay, and you're executing it. You're on the go, all right? But your gifts, open-minded, okay? So you're open-minded to new ideas, to learning new things, right? May have paranor paranormal experiences, okay? So you may be astral traveling, out-of-body experiences, uh, different, you know, um, in your dream state. Uh, we call it lucid dreaming. You feel like you're asleep, but you're awake, but you're asleep, okay? Interest in astrology or astronomy, um, so some of you guys are scientists out there, some of you guys are astrologers, um, some of you guys are tarot readers, but getting in tune with your spiritual gifts, right? Your challenges, feeling like you don't belong, like I just said, you feel alienated, right? So you're coming in alignment with your soul tribe, like-minded people, trust issues, okay? So you may have been hurt in the past or, you know, cheated on, whatever, betrayed by friends and family, Okay, but learning to trust again, but trusting in the universe and trusting yourself. Okay, I don't believe, you know, trust is a big issue for me as well. Learning can be challenging. So, speed wants you to be open-minded to learn new things, okay, along your journey. As long as we're uh, alive, uh, we're still learning. We're going to learn to the day we die, right? So, be learn, learning can be challenging. So, just be open-minded and just take what you can, all right? You know, we could learn from children. But listen, you lived on a different planet as a hybrid species and learned some very unusual skills. Okay, so, <laughs> all right, so you learned some very unusual skills. So what are you doing with those unusual skills, right? What are you doing? You guys are very talented. What are you doing with that? All right, okay, so let's continue. You're coming to, you're, you're coming in, you're coming in alignment with your authenticity. Okay, yes. Being who you are, true to yourself. Law of attraction. 
law of attraction some of you, uh, animals may gravitate to you some of you guys may love animals or be veterinarians out there okay yes um, but it says law of attraction each thought is an investment that pays immediate dividends so invest wisely pay attention to your thought process never think lack think that you already have it you already have it okay you have the power to choose your thoughts and align I am aligned with the present them with love peace and harmony at your request we will gladly attune your energies to higher frequencies okay so stay prayed up at this time and you know to raise your vibration put up on some uplifting music to raise your vibration guys okay yes It says unlimited okay so your mindset is unlimited you have unlimited potential okay so it says I create some of you guys may have bangs a short haircut with bangs a Cleopatra look uh, I create my reality with the thoughts again special to your thoughts I think and things I focus on I am unlimited in my ability to create a beautiful life full of good and love okay so again you're manifesting so pay attention to your thought process because laws of attraction what you think is what you manifest, okay? In real, in reality, all right. Seven seventeen. Start a new course or research information that will help you to enhance your knowledge base that aligns, everything is alignment, that aligns with your goals and pursuits. Again, finding purpose, on the right path, you're on the go, but you're trying to come into alignment with your life purpose and what you're here for. So Spirit is saying research and gather more information. Open mind, the challenge is, your challenge is learning can be challenging. So spirit wants you to, to learn and to grow and to develop so that way you can teach others or, you know, sh spread knowledge to others. Okay. But it's aligning with your goals and what you're pursuing. All right. So researching, studying. Okay. Focus, but staying focused. Books, again, education and knowledge, learning, going back to school, teaching others. Some of you guys may be educators out there, going for that PhD or master's degree or bachelor's degree, whatever it is. But whatever craft or whatever it is that you want, your endeavors or what you're passionate about, Spirit wants you to continue to learn and build your knowledge about it. Okay, but education and knowledge, books, get some self-help books. Some of you guys are journalists writing, writing uh, your own book to help others. Okay, but whatever it is, Spirit wants you to research the information. Okay, yes, learn it, learn it, learn it. Okay. It says trust. Spirit, Spirit wants you to trust in the process. You're under development. But trust that everything is going to be okay and work out in your favor. Okay? Trust that you're on the right path. Okay? Yes. So let me pull some tarot here to see what's going on. What you need to pay attention to justice, okay? Being fair. It's being fair with other non judgmental. Some of you guys are going to court at this time. Some of you guys are going to law school, okay? Um, yes. But it's like cause and effect, okay? Again, law of attraction. What you put out is what you get back. Some of you guys are trying to find balance within your life, but give yourself justice, okay? Some way, somehow. But there's lawsuits here, all right? Or going to court. Some legal issues going on here. Ace of Wands, people are being taken out. But Ace of Wands is all about implementing your ideas. Some of you guys may be getting something copyrighted or trademark or, 
you know, uh, an idea of some sort. You're you're um, getting it legalized, a business or some sort. Okay, yes. But paperwork um, being taken out here. Okay, but learning, learning the law as well. Okay, but it's all about, it's a breakthrough coming. It's a breakthrough coming. Spirit is saying to continue on. Um, give, they're giving you the encouragement to continue on of, when, of what you're passionate about. Okay, yes, there's opportunities arising. Yeah, the lovers, okay, yes, this may be partnerships as well, okay, but there, I do see a part of your soul tribe coming in to help you along the way. Hold on, guys. Yes, I do see some type of partnership coming in, okay, things picking up for you as well. Mm -hmm. Lots of money coming in for you. But it's a waiting game. You're about to close out a cycle. You're entering into a new phase in your life. Wheel of Fortune. Destiny is on your side, guys. Okay? Yeah. You feel like it's taking a long time. Okay? This court situation. You want to move forward. But whatever it is, it's long-term success. But perseverance. The rewards are coming in for your hard work and diligence. Trust in the process. It's a waiting game. Yeah. Seven of Wands. I do see you guys are very defensive as well. I do see somebody defending you in a case here. Uh-huh. Some of you guys are having sleepless nights. There's a lot of anxiety, depression going on here. Okay. It's like a mental block. It's like uh, rebuilding. You're trying to rebuild yourself um, after some type of loss here. I'm hearing mistake. A mistake. Yes, there's somebody ruling. Okay, there's a judge here, I feel, um, that's ruling over a case here. Or there's somebody, a mentor of some sort. Some of you guys may be already the boss. But again, I do see a collaboration that's going to come in. Something that you've been waiting for a very long time. Your money is picking up. Okay, but oh, I see money. I see money coming in. Yeah, the Hierophant. Some of you guys are married out there as well. Religious factors, uh, spiritual factors here. God is on your side. Stay prayed up at this time. Yeah, the devil. Some of you guys are um, get rid of codependent, a codependent relationship, a toxic relationship, a toxic marriage, separation going on here. Um, I do see um, some type of addictions going on here, codependency, sex, but you're blocking this out the star spirit wants you to stay hopeful during this time okay stay hopeful during this time because i do see things working out in your favor some of you guys may need a spiritual bath as well a cleansing of some sort but you're really in a toxic environment toxic mindset yeah queen of wands you're looking good though okay you're looking good there's somebody that's in love with you, somebody from your past or a past life love, somebody that you know from the past. Yeah, but spirit wants you to remain optimistic at this time because I do see star status and I do see a proposition coming in. Yeah, you see, I keep seeing this nine of swords. Oh, you guys are restless, four of swords, uh, not speaking to anyone, remaining hidden, remaining silent. Some of you guys are tire readers or getting some type of insight in your life. Okay, yes, things are coming to an end here uh, in a connection. And the chariot, things are going to be picking up in your life. But endings bring new beginnings, guys. Okay, so remain optimistic and follow your intuitions. Whatever it is, follow your intuitions. Okay, yes, and trust in the divine. Trust, trust in the process. It's taking a while, but trust in the process. Okay. So you guys may have me be having health concerns as well. Major life change. Yeah. So there's the change. Again, five. Time is right for major life changes. As a new lifestyle or location brings great joy and trouble-free existence. Moving. Like I said, moving. The change begins with you though. Okay. So trust in the process. Because I do see you moving forward. Okay. And I do see a new love entering into your life. There's a decision in love. But 
Again, endings bring new beginnings, okay? Let me pick one more, and um, I'm closing out your reading, my dear Cancers. What risk can I take this week? Okay, so what risk can you take? It says... Be not mistaken, you will have to take bigger risks than you ever thought possible on this path towards your dreams. You will have to take the big, scary leap, but do not fret because your soul has wings. What risk can you take to move towards your dreams? Make a decision and do it. No more thinking, only doing. Be brave and courageous and you will discover what you are really made of. I think uh, Taurus got this reading, so you may be dealing with a Taurus. But what risk can you take? Okay. All right, Cancers, that's all I have for you. Uh, uh, I'm possible. You're possible. Your girl, Tosh. I'm out.